Manu Prashantasya Paramatma Samahita Sitos Nasuka Dukkeshu Tathamana Pamana Yohom Yana Vigyana Truptatma Utasto Vijit Indriya Yukta Vijit 
ಯುಚತೆ ಯೋಗಿ ಸಮಲೋಷ್ಟಾಸ್ಮಕಾಂಚನ ವನು ಯಾರ್ ಸಿಟಿಂಗ್ ಡೌನ್ ಕ್ವಾಯ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಟುಡೇ ಐ ಡೆಲಿಬರೇಟ್ಲಿ ಚೋಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟು ಸ್ಪೀಕ್ ಎನಿಥಿಂಗ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟು ಸೇ ಎನಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಒನ್ ವೆರಿ ನೈಸ್ ಐಡಿಯಾ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಫ್ಲಾಸ್ ಥ್ರೂ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಶೇರ್ ಇಟ್ ಇತ್ ಯು ಇಟ್ಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ should your alertness begin when you are seated in the car or you start driving ask yourself the question when the alertness is more important think for yourself It's a beautiful point. When is the alertness more important? When you are seated in the car, parked car, or the moment you start driving, starting the engine and driving. definitely you should be totally alert the moment your car is on the move exactly the same way you should be conscious when you are simply sitting down in a room under a tree or you should be conscious when you start negotiating with the world should we be conscious when you have closed your eyes keeping quiet or should we be conscious the moment you open your eyes use your sense organs interact with people so when is the meditation when you should be conscious think please that is why <laughs> if you recognize this keeping quiet in wonder a tree or on a mountain suddenly seems less glamorous less important of course you do so to begin with as do but once you that is why this teaching when you recognize this when shall this teaching be more useful more needed when you close your eyes or when you start interacting the moment you start driving the car you must be totally alert are you getting that point please when you are seated on a parked car if you are not alert will it con- will it cause any accident is you are on a parked car in your physical body apojiva sitting down with your body closing your eyes if you are absent minded you lost track of it you close your eyes you are sleeping that is how people cheat themselves half an hour meditation means either sleep forgetfulness some type of a struggle or some type of a absent mindedness for most people it is like that when you are sitting down you are trying to be alert while interacting you give up what's the idea that's not meditation are you getting that point please must see 
the moment you start interacting with people that is the time you must be conscious or else you are a practitioner of meditation but full of agitation throughout your life's activity so there is a huge compartmentalization a dichotomy a distance a duality between your so called meditation and your living a life please understand when you are aruda settled in yourself absolutely sure of yourself you are as conscious as you are sitting down alone even that conscious or if i can use the word more conscious when you are interacting with the world not necessarily with another person even you start seeing hearing tasting touching because with that harmless innocent perception of a sight a sound or a touch or a taste begins your complicated emotional response perception can be very innocent but the next step your reaction to the perception drives you crazy so not necessary you are interacting with another person are you getting that please is not necessary you are interacting with another person but as even you start seeing hearing tasting touching smelling experiencing with your sense with your body now you are alert so your meditation your meditativeness you are being conscious should it be confined to your seat of meditation or it should be much more effective or much more essential the moment you step out that idea came as a, it is something please understand you don't have to sit down inside a parked car consciously you can you can afford to sleep so when you are practicing meditation you can successfully cheat yourself practice sleeping it doesn't matter the moment you driving you cannot fall asleep can you because fear comes grips you oh accident are you that way conscious just like when you are driving a car you are keeping alert because you don't want to meet with an accident there is a fear of death can you do the same thing that the moment you keeping your eye open and you are going out into the world interacting with people you should be afraid there may be an emotional death there may be an intellectual death there may be a physical collision no i don't want any collision i want to be conscious it makes it very easy for you to be conscious in life are you getting that because i don't want to get into a mess as you are driving on the road understand as you are driving on the road they have written there no sharp curve there is a possibility of accident here accident zone when you are seated on a car do you have any such notice when you are parked on a car any such notice not necessary because you are in one place oh this is something really beautiful in a parked car body parked and sitting down what are the zone difficult zones whatever happens in your mind makes no difference to you because you are alone but what do you do people that is the time go on fighting with their thought because assuming the role of a meditator oh, please see through that see through that eh assuming the role of a meditator you are unnecessarily fighting with your thoughts of many kinds 
that meditation means no thought or this thought should not be there, one thought should be there, should not be there. You do not cover even a little distance. Only when you interact with people, there is some result. <laughs> the person in meditation wastes the whole life under a tree. Whole life on a mountain. Never saw, heard, tasted, touched, smelled this amazing universe with such varieties. Totally introvert. All in the name of meditation, spirituality, religion. And wasted himself. So many things to be seen in this world. Heard, tasted, touched, smelt. Not for sake of happiness. Just for celebrating life itself. Imagine. How many things. Yesterday there was a news piece, a piece of news. They saw the green sun. In Orisha, what happened is in newspaper, in national newspaper, it came. With the color of the cloud, something somewhere went crazy. Instead of a red sun, they said green sun. Everybody was looking at it. Will you ever get a chance to see that? Just think of it. This celestial phenomenon, like, you know, that moon with two stars on its lap planets. Will it ever come back again? A full solar eclipse going to happen July 22nd. Eh? July 8th, uh, August sometime. It's going to happen. Eh? Please watch out. It's a fast thing through India. I won't be there in India. I am already feeling stupid. Because this solar, full solar eclipse will happen after hundreds of years again. This is going to be the almost the last century in this century, they say. This particular type of solar where the that uh, diamond ring will come. Diamond ring means when the umbra, that that um, shadow is just passing out, the sun, whoosh, light comes. Like a whoa. I had seen it in uh, Konarak, 1978. You have to be very careful watching all the right type of things or else your eyes can be lost. Very powerful rage. Anyway, so many things to be seen in the world. Person must know how to see. Your alertness begins, understand. That alertness is natural. Why? Because you are afraid of collision. When you are driving, you don't have to tell a driver, don't, you know, be, be alert. Because he knows if he meets with an accident, he's the first victim. He'll be alert. Parked in the car, he doesn't have to be. He can sleep. That is why practicing meditation, when sitting down in meditation, suppose I say be conscious, for what? Yes, of course you should be conscious so that you don't feel asleep, fall sleepy. But the moment you start interacting, which one is more important? When shall you be more alert? When you are sitting down by yourself or you are interacting with people? But all the time the emphasis is given when you are sitting down alone, be alert. Hey, what about interacting with people? Are you getting that? While interacting with people, only collision course. When you are sitting down alone, with whom do you collide? With your own thoughts. Anyway, it is there already with you. Please think. It's so beautiful. The best part of it is we are in absolute safety zone. There is no collision between consciousness and anything. You understand the relief? What a relief it is. There is no collision course. There is no accident. There is no accident zone in the universe. Because nothing collides with consciousness. If your individuality is there, your collision course begins. 
If your individuality is not there, there is no collision course. In a lake, so many boats are floating. Suppose you take a boat for your morning boat ride. And as you are rowing your boat and going, there are so many boats are floating, free boats, let's say floating. The boats which are not occupied, will you shout at it? Give way, give way, come on, go to your left, go to your left, will you shout? No. What do you do? You take the right route. You avoid the unoccupied boat. Why? With that boat is not occupied. You avoid the unoccupied boat. You don't shout, go, 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 go. You cannot go out of the way. Now, when you are the occupied boat called a body, should you shout at sense objects to disappear? Sound should not be there, thought should not be there, touch should not be there, smell should not be there. When the, what is that boy? Our uh, Shiva, just now he made some beautiful noise, eh? synchronizing with the classes. You finished, he started. Oh, so beautiful. Did you tell him, shut up? Why? Because he is unoccupied boat. He is unoccupied boat. There is no individuality. See, the squirrel, unoccupied boat. Peacocks, unoccupied boat. If they start shouting, they're moving, what do you say? Do you, call a, do you say Shiva? Shut up! Shut up! What is this coming late and coming to the front? You don't say that, but to another human being you say. Why? The fellow is shouting, occupied boat. To an occupied boat, you go on telling things. But an unoccupied boat, you don't say that. Now, if you are not an occupied boat, where is the, con where is the collision? Just think. The other person may collide with you. Now it's up to you. For Bebahara, you may say, do this or don't do this. But deep within, you are unaffected. Always alert. Pure consciousness as such. That is why, please see. Oh, it is. I hope. Do you see what I see? Do you understand? You cannot complain. Such a person automatically is a yoga rude, jita atmana, prashantasya, paramatma samahita. So sweet it is. Jita atmana, jita antakarana, jita atmana, karya karanadi sanghata, atma jita yena. Who has completely understood the whole mechanism of the Body, that is the Karya Karanadi Sangat means body, sense organs, mind, everything. So, you are totally alert. The moment your perception begins, you are now alert. Why interacting begins? It's just like you're observing a snake. Huh? Suppose you see the snake showing his hood out of the hole. Now you know, ah, there is a snake. Now he comes out. Oh, the whole thing comes out. Ah, wonderful. Now he goes around, walking, everything. You are watching, watching, watching. Now, you don't know anything. You're sitting down, suddenly a snake comes. Oh, you jump. What happened? <laughs> suddenly the snake comes. A thought just rising its head in your consciousness. The thought just rising its head. Aha. Uh -huh, begins. Now suppose it is going on. Helplessly building up. Or the memories are flashing up. Associated memories coming up. Now become big crowd. Oh. Then what happens? You are with yourself. It disappears. That is why you are so conscious, so alert. The moment perception begins, your alertness begins. That is why sopnantam jagaritantam. End of your sleeping, end of your waking. Until sopnantam jagaritantam. 
the end of your sleep and the end of your waking until that whoo, complete alertness you touch your hand you know you put your hand here also you know <laughs> movement some people will be doing things sitting down thing talking this not knowing what they are talking you don't experience it i'll give help you to understand just be little conscious when you are chanting bhagavad gita if you are before time to chant that also is a big thing because you are sitting down in the room and of course lost in meditation you know uh, food time is not known why because once other people finish chanting then my food time begins but my going and chanting oh you you also so big crime you understand say so alertness of life you can understand your alertness so by chance you make a mistake of going on a time and you are starting the chanting with others also then you shall see you start with om urdhva moola madasakham you will remember then the last one it is shrimad bhagavad gita so vanasat so you have chanted the whole thing but you do not remember you have chanted is like mind takes over an automatic pilot is like an automatic pilot it takes over you don't make a mistake the whole thing goes chanting is over is like you will be even sitting down here you will be reading and chanting the mantra but you don't know that you are chanting suppose somebody just stop uh, you come back to stop it why suddenly stopped look at test yourself out testing yourself out this knowledge you must test yourself out every moment then only is beauty or else you will be a talking machine it means nothing oh you should be conscious why you, uh, you should be why should others should be conscious that's why you feel that i always conscious alert even if you make a mistake what is perceived as a mistake by other people you are aware think of it you must see prasaje person jitatma na jitantakaranasya prashantasya paramatma samahita if you are a person alert conscious every moment प्रशांत तस्मा प्रशांत वेरी शांत प्रकर्षेण शांत शम शांत प्रसन्नात्मा प्रसन्नकरण वेरी हापी क्वाइट पीसफुल डिस्पोजिशन पीसफुल डिस्पोजिशन नॉट लेजी डिस्पोजिशन दर इज ए डिफरेंस बिटवीन पीसफुल डिस्पोजिशन एंड लेजी डिस्पोजिशन peaceful disposition is alert active lazy disposition is uh, sleepy well quite both are but in one quite should there is darkness the other quite should there is light is like you are alone in sunlight no fear you are alone in the darkness fear in the total darkness of the night you are alone there is a fear but you are alone in the total uh, sunlight There is no fear. You are alone in consciousness, no problem. In alone in forgetfulness, fear. Ah, I don't know what is going to happen. If the fear is coming, you are not being aware of yourself. So prasanta antakarana, prasannaatma, paramatma samahita. For such a person, paramatma samahita is something. Atma bhave na vartate. it existing as your own self sito usna sukha dukkeshu so this is what naturally happens to you sita usna sukha dukkeshu tatha mana apamana yoho samam because of your alertness being with yourself the person is same sita usna now it is hot now it is cold only climate no some people are warm to you the same person is cold to you Shitaushna, don't think only outside climate. Huh? People can be very cold. People can be very warm. 
Some people can be sizzling hot. Some people can be shimmering hot. Some people can be frozen eyes. You understand? Different eyes of people. Sometimes have you not seen? The same person. Please come, sit down. Oh, so friendly. Another time. I don't want to look at the shadow of the fellow. Ah, that's what it is. What happens to you? Sometimes you think of a person. Oh, that's a pleasure. The same thought comes. Or anger. Why? Why? What happened? Oh, Swamiji, he is my dream. She is my dream. Oh. What happened to the dream? Nightmare. <laughs> Why suddenly dream is nightmare? What happened to you? The person makes it nightmare or you make it nightmare? Understand? There is a very nice joke somebody said. When I am dreaming of a girl and I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm dreaming of a girl and I'm going to get married to her. And that is why I'm looking for a mirage silence, mirage license. <laughs> Outside real girl, real boy, marriage license. Dream girl, dream boy, mirage license. <laughs> Imagining, no? Imagining. Think of it. Sita Ushna Sukadukke Ishu. All these things will happen. Not only climate, cool and warm, but also people can be cool and warm. Sukadukke Ishu. Sukadukha. Mana apamana yo. See, it's just not, you know, a statement. What is most important is how much of this knowledge you are really expressing this knowledge into your lifestyle. Mana apamana yo tulya. That is why you don't react when somebody as though insulting you or humiliating you. Nor you feel great when somebody is praising you. You do not understand. Please appreciate. You do not understand. If you feel elevated, elated when being praised, you are just organizing a platform to crash when the person withdraws his compliment. There is no elevation. Oh, somebody said I'm so nice. Somebody said so nice. Now the same somebody say you are stupid, you are finished. What about yourself? What do you think of yourself? What do you... Yes, even the lizard understands. What do you think of yourself? So important, so important. Uddharet Atmana Atmanam. You understand the statement, right? Eh? Uddharet Atmana Atmanam. Natmanam Avasadet. May you lift yourself by yourself. Urdhuam Nayet. Natmanam Avasadet. Never look down upon yourself. Why? It's not an injunction because. You are not a self which can be put down, looked down upon. Flawless, infinity, imperishable existence. Your roles have limitation. Yesterday I told you. Your roles have limitation. Comparison. You cannot escape comparison when it comes to the level of roles. It is incomparable when it is being yourself. Roles will be different. The riches that you have, the riches the other person have. Some, you know, it shall be differences. Body, you look at your own body. Somebody by birth is small, somebody by birth is big. Somebody by birth, you have no contribution towards the shape and size of your body. What, what, are, what is your contribution towards the look that you have, your shape and size that you have? That is how it will be. And there shall be a comparison. No choice. Now don't say, oh, his nose is bigger, my tail is smaller. His leg is like this. My uh, foot is like that. Don't ever. 
my body is the best why my body can you be like that you understand i'm not telling you joke i's not a pep talk you must know that my body is the best body why because in my body others body that is best for him that one best for her also each one's body why body is so beautiful without the body is no access to the universe it's not miss universe competition is not mr universe competition is a matter of life and death your body is the best body in the world why because your body is available for you maintain it for your sake for first for your sake then for others sake also because if you fall sick others are in trouble also no think of it what do you think of yourself what do you cannot escape comparison same thing also your eyes oh my eyes are like this her eyes are like who is you know my nose is low now that nose is sharp eh hey? what is this my face is that face is like that hey so what i yes your full head i have no hair ha huh? wonderful i have no hair why no problem any time ready to get out if i have hair now what a headache you have to do all that headache no and by chance you know there is no hair means there are so many advantages <laughs> so many advantages by chance you know there is a people are taking a movie and the forgotten reflector just <laughs> so few reflectors there <laughs> and you have got only match stick but the box is not there Have you not seen that uh, Laurel Hardy thing? <laughs> <laughs> and it goes so many ways. And the rain comes, oh, automatically rolls down. You don't have to hold it. No hair is held. No water is held on the top. Just sit down. It goes. And uh, hair cut once in six months, once in three or six months. Only thing is you have to pay more. When you go to the Hair cut fellow, well, he earns charges more. I asked him how much you charge? Fifty, fifty rupees head. People with the full head only twenty rupees for without uh, my I don't have any hair. He said that's what I have to look for it. <laughs> 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 I have to look for the hair. So fifty rupees I have to pay. You have to pay for it, right? The other fellow says uh, one fellow, bald fellow went to a shop. he said can you give me haircut with my suit on my suit on tie on everything he said why i can even give you haircut with your hat on <laughs> so you see the advantages you understand but if you say oh i have no hair oh, i have no head i have no tail hey that's not the point those things are comparable region comparable zone that is a graduate i am a post graduate he is undergraduate he is 10th standard post he is all relative knowledge even the best is yet to come can you be yourself in comparable zone ah. absolute confidence in yourself that is why look at the great saints What is? Were they PhD from the university? Are they Mister Universe, Miss Universe? None of this nonsense. That is why, as a Brahmacharya or Swami sitting down there and fixing up your hair also, head also, fixing up, how I will appear. Huh? Unless I do like the suppose the girl will not look at me. Oh, I see. Suppose the boy will not look at me. You don't have. To. Therefore, don't say all dirty, looking at the boy. No body care. No. but don't ever try to do something because you feel that oh if i chance i put on ordinary dress what will happen that is why uniform just put on one fancy dress every day tomorrow same thing any time you are ready to meet the governor as well as the beggar same dress you don't have to change your dress <laughs> same thing no problem why who you are is so beautiful it expresses through every role that you play every dress gains a beauty every role gains a beauty because who you are is so attractive so beautiful people will forget what you are putting on 
People will forget what you are eating or not eating. You know, when you are you getting that? When you love a person, think of it, when you love a person, you are attracted towards a particular dimension. You like the professor because he is top mathematician. You don't mind what dresses he puts on, what laughs or jokes or does anything because mathematics, you are into that. A musician, you love his music. Oh, the fellow is drinking, who cares, man? That music, music. Now the whole world is missing that boy who is dead now. What is it? Michael Jackson. Now suddenly all his records are selling 200%. Poor thing died with the, what is that? Debt. Now the fellows are making money who are selling his, what is that? Records and CDs and all these things. But he died in full debt. Nobody says now, oh, he was abusing child or he was not proved and all that thing or he was eccentric and he was living in like this thing. Or who now talks about it? Nobody talks about it. Now music, the album, the thrill, beat it. Everybody purchasing, everybody purchasing. What happened? Music. If you have a quality, everybody will forget everything. They look at that. And what can be more beautiful than the truth, the absolute itself? <laughs> Infinity. Literally splashing through the splendorous limitations of your body and the mind. Tasmat. Sita, Ushna, Sukadukkesh, Mana, Apamana, Yoho, Tulya. You don't look down or you don't feel bad because somebody is talking this or that to you. Are you a person like that? Yoga Arudha Jnana Vijjana Trupta Atma Jnana Vijjana Trupta Antakarana Let Shankara talk. Okay? Beautiful. Please see. Underline that commentary there. On the next page, if you have the commentary with you, don't worry about it. Jnana Vijjana Trupta Atma When Vishwa takes that, you can see that. Jnana Vijjana Trupta Atma means Jnanam. What is Jnanam? Sastrokta Padarthanam Parijnanam. Vijnanam tu Sastratah Jnatanam Tathayeva Svanubhava Karanam Tabhyam Jnana Vijnana Abhyam Trupta. So what is Jnana? Sastrokta Padarthanam Parijnanam. Sastrokta Padarthanam. Jnana knowledge is Whatever the Shastra, the scriptures are revealed as it is. Talking about yourself from your relative dimension to the absolute dimension. Beginning from your body to the bodiless awareness. That is Jnanam. That is the knowledge you get from the scripture. Vijnanam du Shastratah Jnatanam Tayayeva Sva Anuhava Karanam Whatever you have heard from the scripture, tatha sva anubhava karanam, you see it in your mind very clear. Until today, it was information in the book. Now it is myself. The shastra is my description. Jnanam. Vijnana is, it is me. Simple. Are you getting that point, please? The de are you getting that? Eh? The description is, the descri when you see, in Shastra, they give you your description. Now you saw your description. Listen, you read your description. You heard your description. Are you getting that? You read your description, Shastra. You heard your description, Shastra, Jnanam. I am the description, I am the described Vijnana. It was my description, now I know it is me. <laughs> Simple, are you getting that? It was my description, but now I know it's me. It's me only described there. When I start, my description. When I end, is me. So, Vijnanam, Jnana Vijnana Tuttatma. That is why you become so, 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 so refreshing. Why? Because words, how many words can describe the infinity? 
So you can go on seeing the infinite dimensions. Are you getting that? That's why when you look at yourself, so many ideas simply flash through you. So many ideas because that is me. You describe. It is just like somebody can give a general description of, uh, uh, what is that, uh, 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 Thiruvannamalai. But when you are living here, how much you see? The heat of it, the cold of it, the, uh, all the different birds, the flowers, the, uh, this, uh, the evenings, the mornings, the sunrise, the sunset, the uh, mountain in its different moods, sometimes fully covered uh, clouds, sometimes no covering, sometimes just a cloud is sitting on the top. What all descriptions? Same thing also about yourself. When you see, you recognize yourself who, are, who you are, all these things happen to you. General description. But the detail, every moment you can see, who can describe it? Jnana Vigyana Trupta Antakarana. Trupta Atma, Trupta Antakarana. Very satisfied with all the description about yourself. Very contented with who being who I am. Tasmat Kutastha. Kutastha Bhavati. Aprakampyo Bhavati. No prakampanam, no kampanam. Kutastha, kutavatti shthati. Absolutely steady it existing. Kutavatti shthati means kuta. Like uh, the kuta is like an anvil. In an anvil, in the blacksmith shop, in an anvil is a hard iron. The heated irons are heat on the anvil to bring it to different shapes. Heated iron, heat by the hammer to bring it to different shape. Itself never changes, but allows all changes to take place on it. So, kutastha, aprakampya, consciousness never changes, but allows every changes to take place on it. Suppose it, with every heat of the hammer, not only the, the molten iron or the red hot iron changes, but also the... <laughs> the the anvil also goes on shaping, changing the shape. What a headache it will be. So with the every changing thought, if you are the foundation, the basis also goes on changing. What a waste. It doesn't. Kutastha vijita indriya indriya vijita jena jita jena visheshena jita for whom all the sansargans mana sasthan indriyani five sansargans ajaraj mana completely you are the one who use them, Vijita Indriya. Sansargans, you are using. Ask, that is why, ask yourself question. When shall you know your mastery? Seated on a parked car or driving a car? An ace driver is not one who is seated on a parked car. Ace driver is one who is controlling this speedy car. Who is the topmost driver? Who is to control the car in the topmost speed? Huh? Who is the top driver? F1. 300 kilometers per hour. Woo! Before you look at from this end to that end, he has already gone. If any time you ever get a chance to, even movie it also you look at it, TV you look at, or real life, uh, if you see the, you know, the sound will kill. It's like Mach 4, Mach 1, Mach like sound barrier crossing. These powerful cars will be going, the motorcycle also. Such a speed. Looking at it, you are frightened. But the ace driver, why? Complete control. So who is the master of the Sansarganas? Seated under a tree for 20 years. Master. Yes, a different type of mastery. Why? I can't sit down 20 seconds. He's sitting 20 years. <laughs> what is the achievement? Don't ask. Oh, he has done his life. At least his biggest achievement is you know what? He may not be blessing people, but he is not hurting anybody. That's a huge con you know, concession, isn't it? You don't have to do anything as long as you are not confusing people. You don't have to teach as long as you are not teaching ignorance. You don't have to help, but don't create a problem for me. Appa, what a thing. 
टॉप स्पीड बट फुल कंट्रोल बिजित इंद्रिय संसर्गन सीइंग एक्टिविटी फुल एक्टिविटी बट नो एक्सीडेंट नो कोलाप्स विजित इंद्रिय युक्त इतिहुचते योगी हे अर्जुन सचे पर्सन इज योगी युक्त इतिहुचते वी कॉल हिम युक्त सचे पर्सन समलोष्टा अश्मकांचन समलोष्टा अश्मकांचन he looks upon everything same. What? Losta. Cloud of earth, asma, stone, kanchana, gold. All the three, one and the same. Meaning, mad man. Which doesn't differentiate between gold and the stone and the uh, mud. So sometimes makes a house on a mud, sometimes on a stone, sometimes on gold also. Eh? Or throws into, you want monkeys coming, takes a gold and throw it as a monkey. Why? Stone and gold, one and the same. Not that way. Samalostasma Ganjana means all the three are one and the same. Three things have their own place. You are not more attracted by this, less attracted by that. Each one has a place of its own. A, an interesting story goes, there is a husband and wife. Both are say, saints, very saintly people. Both are walking. And when the man was ahead walking and the girl was following him. Then he saw there is a ring on the road, golden ring. The man thought, oh my God, if my wife will see now, she will be interested because she is, usually you associate. Woman means more uh, uh, crazy for the ornaments or gold. If she looks at it, she will be interested. So she sat down and put some dust on it. Then I walking. And then wife got up with him. He said, why you slow down? What were you doing there? But she is, he is very honest. He should told her, look, I saw a little piece of gold. So I thought you may feel attracted by it. So I was covering it up with the dust. Then he said, why are you covering dust with the dust? It's a real incident. Why are you covering dust with the dust? That is the attitude. Deep within you see that. Essentially, everything is same. Then use it as a different thing altogether. But, please see. Samarostasma kanchan. Nothing ever distracts you. Nothing, nothing. Okay. Not only in, only in relation to the, what is that, uh, Samarostasma kanchan. Inanimate things. No, animate also. Read. Surun Mitra Rudasina Madhyastha Dvesha Bandhushu Sadhu Shwapi Chapa Peshu Samabuddhi Vishishyate Surun Mitra Rudasina Madhyastha Dvesya Bandhushu Sadhu Shwapi Chapa Peshu Samabuddhir Vishishyate See the beauty? First he gives you Samalostasma Kanchana. How you look at the inanimate world as one and the same. It may be easy to look at the inanimate world as one and the same. But, can you look at human relationship also one and the same? Because in the world, please understand, it is easy to deal with the inanimate sense objects. Only human beings are the biggest problem. Do you fight with your house or with your husband and wife? When you are living in a house, do you fight with your house or with your partner? The fight is between the brothers or between the houses. The fight is between the countries or between the people. The fight is between the gods and the religions or fight is between the followers. People, people, people. <laughs> Suppose you and me fight, our dogs will also join the fight. The dogs will jump on each other. Your dog, my dog, they don't understand. Like children. Children of the both houses, they don't know. So they go and play with each other. The parents go 
through heavy emotions. Don't go to that house. The child doesn't understand as to why. Until yesterday it was okay. Today why it is not okay? The child doesn't understand. <laughs> so you have to put a wall around your house. They don't come, I don't go. Yes, border. <laughs> Human being. This is my bedroom, this is your bedroom. Until today, it is all our house. Tomorrow onwards, this is my bedroom, that is your room. This is my kitchen, your kitchen. Divided wall. Brothers. What happened? House fighting? House divided. Wall divided. Human beings. Human beings. Oh boy. Human relationship. And a human relationship. In a human relationship, who is the first ingredient? I or the other person? Other person, right? Not you are. N U T T Y. In a human relationship, you want to relate, first is you. Yes. He understands clearly. Yes. See, he says that. No, no, please appreciate. Do not ever just uh, let it not be like a resounding board on your ear. You know, you are the first one. Don't say, you know, suddenly let it not pass. Does it really penetrate? Does it go into your system that you are the first? You must fix up yourself first. No. What do you say? Even after listening, you want to fix up everybody. That is why you are in deep trouble. Everybody must be fixed. Nobody behaves as I expect. Why don't you damn things change your expectation? You have no expectation from yourself, but you have all the expectations from everybody else. That is why people get into trouble. When you switch up your emotions, you switch up your expectations, world becomes so beautiful. But what happens? I want to be crazy and everybody must support my craziness. As I told you yesterday, my dream, others must fulfill. Oh, how wonderful. Somebody must run through me, run for me. Somebody must act for me. Then I shall take the credit. How glorious. It doesn't work. In a human relationship, you are the beginning. Are you getting that point, please? It begins with you before you relate and before you relate, it begins with whom? You. You are crazy. You don't understand yourself. You are not happy with yourself. You are not comfortable with yourself. When you are not comfortable, listen carefully, you are not comfortable with yourself, what does it mean? You want somebody to fill up your life. Are you getting that point? I am not comfortable. Do you understand that? Do you understand what I am talking? I am not comfortable with myself. There is an emptiness. There is a hole in my body, in my mind. There is a hole. Emptiness. I want other people to fill it up. You do not understand your emptiness. Even the universe cannot fill up. Your greediness, the whole world cannot fill up. Your insecurity, no, in, nobody, including God. God himself will be lost in the black hole of your emptiness. Even the God will be lost. Why people change God from God? The so-called gods, you know, those are also limited ent entities. Like my father, my brother, another God uncle also. Sitting down somewhere with a fancy beard. Think of it. See for yourself. It begins with you. I am empty and I'm struggling. What? Somebody must like me. De Do you really appreciate? Somebody will ever like you when you hate yourself? Somebody will ever like you if you hate yourself? It begins with you. Do I like myself? No. Why? I have no money, I have no riches, my body is useless, 
my education, forget it. Job I don't have. My mind, you know, waste. Now you want to be loved. For what? For what? You don't love yourself, you don't like yourself, just think of it. It begins, understand, human, when it's a human relationship, it begins with you. That is why by chance, any time ever, you get hooked onto a person who is empty, you are destroyed. But the person shall suck you up. Because he has his demands. She has her demands. The total demand. You know, this is how the person should be. This is how the person should be. The person will not accept the other person as it is. Impossible. Because only if you are like that, then only you are accepted. If you smile too much, no. Laugh too much, no. Crying too much, no. Riches, no. Poverty, yes. Poverty, no. You know, something. You, whatever idiosyncrasies you have, whatever limitations you have, you want to be filled by the other person. Must look at me only. Talk to me only. Should not say the other person also is great. Should not appreciate anybody else. Only me. Oh boy. You know, you understand what happens. You understand what happens. Your emptiness, nobody, nothing can fill up. Because emptiness of the mind is infinity. Physical emptiness, perhaps somebody can be. Suppose you have got a home. You are going crazy. Fill up this house with money. Maybe somebody can fix it. They can fill it up. But not your emptiness inside. Nobody. So it begins with you. In a human relationship, it begins with you. That is a can you be a person absolutely full and complete? Yes, then you shall accept everybody. Not that you accept somebody is crazy, so be crazy. No. You accept his craziness, then help him to change. That is how it is. You accept somebody's limitation, help him to grow. That is how the person is. That is where your acceptance becomes beautiful. You don't expect the person to change and come. You say, unless you change and come, you will not know the truth. But unless you come, it doesn't change. That is why the teacher, in a teaching, there is a complete accommodation for everybody. Only trouble becomes is when you accommodate somebody, that person thinks he is flawless. That time it becomes a problem. You accept the person, so the person instead of now changing, now he thinks as he is wonderful. That is why it becomes a trouble. That time you accepted me even when I was angry. Now can you, how can I accept you? Hey, that was the beginning stages. If you continue to be like that, it's like the child is talking. That time I was sitting down on you, kicking you, uh, doing everything on you, going to bathroom also on you, and you loved me. And now I am just uh, uh, telling something and you are hating me. Ah, uh, the two different people. That time your baby, innocent. Now you are grown up. Understand? It begins with you. Don't try to change people and then be happy. <laughs> you must see it. Ah. <sighs> You understand? It begins with you. Do not ever delude yourself. Human relationship begins with others. It begins with you. How you are reflected in a relationship. If you radiate You communicate strength, you shall receive strength. 
you communicate acceptance you communicate solid stability the other person will be responding in that way suppose you are you know is just like around a person who is think of a person who is around or around a person both are drunk it becomes difficult you know one fellow uh, was drunk and next day he found himself in the uh, hospital okay he found himself in the hospital then he said oh boy his friend came to visit him hey what happened i remember i was standing in the balcony he said yes you are drunk and you thought you can fly like a you know you are drunk and you thought you can fly like a bird he said yes if i did that what about the friends for you should have told you should have stopped uh, stopped me he said that time i also thought you can fly <laughs> and he was also drunk <laughs> both are drunk is both are drunk what type of relations it becomes that is how it is most people drunk people relate drunken in ignorance drunk with roles masks meet faces the never see masks meet riches marrying riches beauty marrying beauty star you know movie people movie movie people sports people means sports people music people marry music people computer people marry computer people you know that, you see that in life poverty poor people poor people must meet then one person grows other person drops why the mass changes similar masks are not there anymore so natural incompatibility begins but suppose you meet at the base at the root ha huh, no problem absolutely no problem but when you are drunk you forget it like a fellow is in the army he was a he was a line, you know that um, uh, lines man you know what the junior position he was a, the last position he just like a soldier okay he was like a soldier then the other person and but he had a drinking habit then the man said his superior a corporal he says hey ha say the private is as the, the corporal told him look if you can get out of this drinking habit you shall be my like you shall be like me a corporal he said yes but when i drink i feel i'm a general <laughs> so most people want to continue to be generals drunk with power difficult understand so it please anyway so if you are drunk what type of relationship you can begin you are not sure of yourself what type of relationship you can begin before you begin it starts with yourself for god sake for your sake know yourself then what will happen you see the human relationship interaction surut mitra ari udasina madhyastya dveshya bandhusu sadhusu papeshu samabuddhir visishyate such a person the person who is gyana vigyana trupta atma abiding himself arudah yukta hai yogi samabuddhi vishishyate he looks at them one and the same who these are the types of people around surut surut means pratyabhakaram anapeksha upakarta surut one who helps you without expecting any result without any any favor in return that is a surut like on the road you can see you are going down you have fallen somebody just picks you up gives you water and disappears surut he doesn't wait to be thanked doesn't wait to be thanked he just gives it goes away
شروع वन पर्सन मित्र मित्र मीन्स मित्र स्नेहवान पर्सन होम यू लविंग मित्र फ्रेंड ए मित्र फ्रेंड अरि दर सेल ऑल्सो शत्रु अरि मीन्स शत्रु यू मे बी ट्राइंग टू बी वेरी फ्रेंडली बट द अदर बलो लुक्स अपन यू ही लुक्स डाउन अपन यू ही लुक्स अपन यू एज एन एनिमी व्हाट कैन यू डू You like somebody, but the other person hates you. Do you have a choice? Satru, udasina. Udasina means na kashe chit paksham bhajate, kashe chit paksham na bhajate. It doesn't take sides. Udasina. He is okay. He is he. She is also she. Udasina. Sally, are you husband is better or wife is better? Both are my friends. Udasina. Bas. Neither I take sides. Neither this nor that. Udasina. There are some people who are like that. Madhyastha, madhyastha means yo viruddha yo ho, ubay yo ho, iteishi. Madhyastha, ubay yo ho, viruddha yo ho, iteishi. Two people are fighting. He is iteishi for both. Madhyastha, I do good for him, do good for him also. I don't want to be enemy of anybody. Udasina is not doing anything, but madhyastha is he will be there. He will be doing equally good for both. Madhyastha. द्वेश्य द्वेश्य मीन्स आत्म अप्रिय द पर्सन हू गिवस यू डिस्कम्फर्ट दर विल बी सच पीपल दर विल सच पीपल यू मे बी वेरी नाइस बट दे आर फोर डोंट थिंक होल वर्ल्ड विल बी नाइस टू यू दर विल बी सम पीपल दे विल स्पेंड एक्स्ट्रा टाइम क्रिएटिंग ट्रबल फॉर यू दर विल बी सम पीपल द्वेश्य देन बंधुजु बंधु मीन्स रिलेटिव संबंधी संबंधी यू नो रिलेटिव्स बंधुषु साधुषु अभी च पापेशु साधुषु वट इज साधुषु शास्त्र अनुवर्तु द पर्सन दोज हु आर बिजी इन शास्त्र स्टडी पर कार्य साधनों साधु लिविंग पर अदर्स स्टडिंग शास्त्र स्टडिंग स्क्रिप्चर साधुषु पापेशु प्रतिषिद्ध कार्यु सर्वेशु पाप मीन्स द पर्सन हु इज कमिटिंग एवरीथिंग दैट शुड नॉट बी डन प्रतिषिद्ध कार्यु शुड नॉट बी आंग्री इज आंग्री Should not be upset. Is upset. Should not be moody. Is moody. Should not be uh, you know backbiting. Backbiting. Should not gossip. That is the only job to be done. Papa is. Papa does not mean you know killing one mosquito. You know that is also a papa. But these are the papa is. In all these people, samabuddhi. Samabuddhi means I see the same truth here, there, everywhere. These are the different types of roles people do play. Neither you are enamored by somebody's goodness, nor you are burning because of somebody's badness. Understand? You recognize everything as it is. Just like you are traveling on a plane, you are traveling in a sea. Now there is strong breeze. Put up your sail. Move. Very favorable. Put it up. Go. Another one which is not very favorable. Put down yourself. Just let it be there. Use it. Don't use it. Choices. But there is no hatred for anything. What to do? That is how life falls. People. Why is it so? When shall you accept them as they are? When you have nothing to lose or gain. Are you getting that? When shall you accept everybody as they are? Hindi me bata de, mujhe lena dena nahi hai. When you have nothing to lose or gain from somebody, you are least worried about them, right? I'm so happy with myself. I have nothing to lose or gain. You like suppose suppose you expect, oh, if the fellow gives me five lakh rupees, this will be nice. Then you are angry. He is not giving me anything. Or he, you are angry. Is giving somebody and not me. <laughs> but suppose you don't expect it. They are giving. Let them give. Why they have it? But they are giving them. They have the need. You are totally unaffected. Happy with somebody's happiness. It's amazing mind. It's full of confidence. Full of confidence. 
ಅರಿಶಿ ಏನು ಶ್ರೂತ್ ಮಿತ್ರ ಅರಿ ಉದಾಸೀನ ಮಧ್ಯಸ್ಥ ದ್ವೇಷ ಬಂದು ಓಲ್ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಆಸ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ವೈ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಕಾಂಪ್ಲಿಕೇಟೆಡ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ ಟು ಅದರ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಅದರ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಎ ಟು ಎ ಮೌಂಟೇನ್ ಟು ಎ ಕ್ಲೈಮೇಟ್ ಟು ಎ ಟ್ರೀ ಟು ದೀಸ್ ದಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಇಟ್ ಬಿಗಿನ್ಸ್ ವಿತ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಯು ರಿಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಯುವರ್ ಕಾನ್ಫ್ಲಿಕ್ಟ್ ಇನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಎ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಮ್ಯಾನ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿನೆಸ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಸ್ಟೇಬಲ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಸ್ಟೆಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಇನ್ ಅ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಸಿಕ್ಯೂರ್ಡ್ ಆರ್ ಆರ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯೂರಿಟಿ ಇನ್ ಅ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯಾಚ್ಯೂರ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆ್ಯಸ್ ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ಶುಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯೂರಿಟಿ ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ಶುಡ್ ಲುಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಟೆಬಿಲಿಟಿ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಪ್ಯಾರೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಬಿ ಸ್ಟೇಬಲ್ ಪ್ರೊವೈಡಿಂಗ್ ಸ್ಟೆಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರಿಲೇಟಿವ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯೂರಿಟಿ ಟು ಚಿಲ್ಡ್ರನ್ ಬಟ್ ಲೆಟರ್ ಆನ್ ಯು ಗ್ರೋ ಅಪ್ ಯು ಗೆಟ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸೋ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಸೆಕ್ಯೂರಿಟಿ ವಿತ್ ಮನಿ ಸಿಚುವೇಶನ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಶಿಪ್ ಬಟ್ ಹೆಲ್ಪ್ ದಮ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕವರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಸಿಕ್ಯೂರ್ಡ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಅಬ್ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಟ್ಲಿ ಸಿಕ್ಯೂರ್ಡ್ ವಿತ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿನೆಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಫ್ರೀ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ದ ಫ್ರೀಡಮ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಅಬ್ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಟ್ ಜಾಯ್ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸಸ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ವಂಡರ್ಫುಲ್ ಹಪ್ಪ ಸಚ್ ಎ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯೋಗಾರೂಢ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಲೈಕ್ ದಾಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನ ಹರ್ಡ್ ಎನಫ್ ಲರ್ನ್ ಟು ಮೆಡಿಟೇಟ್ ಟು ಮೆಡಿಟೇಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಹೌ ಟು ಕಾನ್ಶಿಯಸ್ಲಿ ಓನ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ನಾವು ಬಿಗಿನ್ಸ್ ದ ಹೋಲ್ ಮೆಥಡ್ ಮೆಡಿಟೇಷನ್ ವಿಚ್ ವಿ ಶಾಲ್ ಸಿ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ನೂನ್ yogi unjita satatam atmanam rahasisthita hai ekakiyata chitta atma nirasira parigraha hai it's beautiful we'll see in the afternoon okay lovely subject ataiva uttama phala prapte you want to get the best result do this this so called meditation you'll start how you start doing it by yourself ah we see in the afternoon okay means you don't want to start the topic the whole thing four five verses will go on we shall see in the afternoon so please see it ask yourself the question always remember that point i told in the beginning of the class the chances are that which is told in the beginning of the class is forgotten at the end of the class remember that when does your alertness begin when you try to sit down quietly sitting in the car or start driving your alertness should begin during the class your alertness should be in the during the class or after the class you are now listening perfectly alert no doubt but the implications implementation implication implementation begins now if the class ends no how much of all that you heard comes into your life or as you step out my chapel you are putting there uh, why can't you put your chapel at little that side on my chapel you should put my your chapel oh your chapel is wounded true <laughs> your chapel is wounded hmm. why are you standing in front of me true, true. see just coming from the class uh, shouting the other person is talking but your agitation is going up that fellow is nuts can you control the other people's nut nuttiness or yours you should sympathize with the person why right? even after this stupid the problem comes when the nutty fellow thinks he is smart the nuts thinks he is smart that is where it becomes little difficult you even then tolerate you understand you know amazing accommodation inside it all begins with you 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 
remember that. When you are confident, you move into the highway, not when other people are driving. When do you get into the highway? Where you are confident of driving. Are you confident? You will be conscious all the time. Yes, I am conscious two hours in my room. So now I am confident I can be anywhere. Okay, try it out. Whole day. Whole day. Then effortlessly, whole life. It's a different game altogether. Okay. Close your eyes, we shall see. You want to have uttama phala prapta, we'll do that in the afternoon. Close your eyes.